मॉर्निंग स्टूडेंट्स हाउ आर यू ओके फाइन ओके आई होप यू हैव लर्न द लेसन्स ऑन जूम आई विल टेक रिविजन ऑफ दिस लेसन्स एंड आई विल सेंड यू प्रैक्टिस शीट ऑल्सो ना वी विल सॉल्व द प्रैक्टिस शीट थ्रू शेयरिंग द स्क्रीन ओके सो नाउ टूडे आई एम टेकिंग द वीडियो फॉर ग्रामर एंड द टॉपिक इज फ्यूचर टेंस already you have learned the present tense past tense present going on past jo ho chuka and future that will come after some time hai na so there is difference between all the three so future tense means whatever will happen in sometimes after baad mein jo hone wala hai so i am going to read the main uh, definition of this the future tense is used to talk about the actions that are expected to take place in the future hai na already you are expecting that this will happen after some time suppose aapko when you see the clouds and you think ki rain may happen so it may rain tomorrow it will rain tomorrow okay so this type of predictions you can give through future tense so in the four situations you can use future tense to predict a future event example it will rain tomorrow you are predicting ki maybe rain come will come tomorrow spontaneous decision you are standing in line for tickets and you didn't have any money so you can say i will pay through my card credit card so you have you are taking decision at the same time on the spot and you will do that action in future so spontaneous decision is taken in future tense Se second thirdly express your willingness aap apna willingness you can show ki you can do this thing or not example i will clean this room so means you are surety aap you are showing willingness i will clean the room means there is surety ki you can do this work after some time and not willingness also you can show hai na i i i will not do this uh, work so willingness and not willingness both you can show through future tense see like a baby will not eat the food means you are showing the not willingness ki means you there is no surety but willingness positive and negative both you can show through future tense and second up you you can use shall shall i open the door so interrogative also you can use for future tense ki you want to open the door after some time you know so shall i say shall you can use for interrogative sentences also but nowadays in modern english will is preferred more nowadays we are using will more than shall you know so here are some exercises that will uh, clear your concept more we add will or shall before verbs to indicate the future tense whenever you see this two word it means the sentence is of future tense i will visit bombay next year see so you are this action you can you can do but after some time so that is a problem of past tense future tense sorry sarika will return your pencil box in the evening means there is surety ki she will return you but she will return after some time so she will return so maximum in sentences there is surety of the work but it will took place after some time see um there are some sentences we can go through this exercises and the common rule is aapko Uh, will plus first form of verb use करना है ठीक है first form means जैसे go went gone so आपको will के साथ go use करना है no went no gone so rule is will plus first form of verb simple so here are the question number a on page number फिफ्टी एट आई एम गोइंग टू रीड द सेंटेंसेज फॉर यू Saurav will become a pilot soon. I will explain you also. Means Saurav will become pilot, but in future. Now it is not in present situation. It is not past situation. 
इट विल बिकम है ना सेकेंड आई विल क्लीन माई रूम ऑन संडे मीन्स ऑन संडे कमिंग संडे यू विल क्लीन द रूम सो इधर विलिंगनेस इज देर कि यू विल क्लीन बट ऑन संडे द टेबल विल ब्रेक इफ यू सी टॉन ठीक है ना मीन्स कंडीशन ऑफ टेबल यू नो इट इज नॉट ब्रेक ब्रेक जस्ट नाउ इट इज नॉट ब्रोकन बट इट विल ब्रेक ठीक है शीना विल शो यू द एल्बम लेटर मीन्स लेटर का मीनिंग क्या है बाद में सो शीना विल शो यू द एल्बम लेटर दे विल विन द मैच एज दे हैव प्रैक्टिस वेरी हार्ड है ना दे विल विन द मैच बट बिकॉज यू नो दैट कि दे हैव प्रैक्टिस सिक्स वी विल गो ऑन अ ट्रिप टू केरेला दिस अक्टूबर मीन्स प्लानिंग यू हैव मेड बट इट विल कम इन एक्शन इन कमिंग मंथ्स सो प्लानिंग ऑलरेडी प्लान बट यू विल फॉलो इन नेक्स्ट मंथ सो इट यू कैन यूज विल रोहित विल पार्टिसिपेट इन द नेक्स्ट स्पोर्ट्स मीट मीन्स नॉ दिस इज स्पोर्ट्स मीट नो नेक्स्ट कमिंग स्पोर्ट्स मीट सो इट विल गो इन फ्यूचर टेंस हसन विल बी अ क्रिकेटर वैन ही ग्रोज अप नाउ एट दिस टाइम ही इज स्मॉल बट ही विल बिकम अ क्रिकेटर वैन ही ग्रोज अप ठीक है सो सिचुएशन इज ऑफ फ्यूचर फिल इन द ब्लैंक्स विद द फ्यूचर टेंस ऑफ द वर्ब्स गिवन बिलो लिस्ट इज गिवन यू हैव टू चूज द वर्ब्स फ्रॉम द बॉक्स एंड यू हैव टू अप्लाई विल एज इट इज इन पास टेंस सो सिंपल यू हैव टू एड विल एंड वर्ब यू हैव टू चूज फ्रॉम द बॉक्स दिट इज क्वेश्चन नंबर बी ऑन पेज नंबर फिफ्टी एट I will watch a movie after I finish my homework. ठीक है After I told you this word I have used all earlier also. So when you finish your work homework then you will go to watch a movie the aeroplane will land in about half an hour theek hai na the music concert will begin on time i will come late for dinner as i have to complete my work see the sentences try to understand the meaning of the sentence and apply ki which tense is using we will cross the finishing line first gilan will not eat dinner with us it is priya's birthday tomorrow she will turn 5 this year na next year abhi birthday is there but now she will go means abhi time is there she will turn into 5 is tomorrow hum past tense ke liye kya use karte hain yesterday and for future tense tomorrow so it is priya's birthday tomorrow so what you will use future tense she will turn 5 this year come with me i will give you a lift now question number c you come to know the difference between past tense and future tense sentences are given in past tense and you have to change into future tense i am going to read both the sentences past tense and then converted sentences romit went to watch a movie when already indication is there when it is used in past tense now you have to convert into future tense so what will come will romit will go and i told you will ke sath what will come first form of verb romit will go to watch a movie second sentence he went to the theater with his parents he went again he will go to the theater with his parents number 3 i hope you are understanding the difference between past tense and future tense the movie began at 7 pm now began is used in past tense so you have to change into future the movie will begin at 7 pm Question sentence four. They bought popcorns in the interval. Bought. What will come? Bring. They will bring popcorn in the interval. Fifth. Romit also ate a burger. Eight. Past tense. Romit will also eat a burger. Sixth. After the movie, 
they went for a walk after the movie they will go for a walk are you getting the difference between both the tenses okay they come back came back at 11 pm came what will come come they will come back at 11 pm eight then they went to sleep then they will go to sleep in this way we have covered the book exercises of future tense practice more for future tenses conditions i have given you three four where to use future tense try to frame more and more sentences on your own you know take a topic and may convert into present write in present tense then convert into past tense then convert into future tense so that your concepts will be cleared and whenever we give some topic to speak on zoom classes or we give topic to write few sentences as a paragraph or we can play a game extempore competition debate so you should be able to speak properly grammatically correct i hope i am cleared with future tense next video tomorrow video will be on the chapter 15 that will be adverb 15 is not in your course it is unseen passage so that you will do yourself we will come to this uh, chapter 16 i think it is on adverbs so next video will be on your adverbs okay till then have a nice day goodbye